hey people welcome back to another tutorial today i'll be showing you how i made this beautiful satin slip lingerie with lace cups if you're new to my channel this is waka waka and i'm abby don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel now on to the tutorial i started by tracing off a front and body sloper pattern which i have and i also lengthen it from my bust i'll be measuring a radius around it my radius is two and a half inches, then I marked it all around. From my bust point, I will also be measuring four inches upwards, which will be the beginning of my straps. And in front of the pattern, stopping at the waistline, I added some extension, which would be for the wrap front. I folded the extension inwards up to the beginning of the dart. Then I mark it. And draw a horizontal line below my radius up to my marked extension. And another line at the start of the strap to the extension. I went to my armhole and made a marking of one inches below it and then draw a line from the start of the strap to the armhole. For my next step, I'll be leaving the waistline dart and I'll be closing all the other dots. with just the center one remaining. I redrew my side, arm hole and the front neckline. I rejoined my front side temporarily and brought in the back, pinned it and draw in my new back line and cut it out from the rest of the pattern. I started by cutting my front and back pattern on bias with allowance all around it. I also cut my satin cups on bias. Then I laid it on my lace and cut it out. While cutting the second lace cup, I made sure the edges matches and then I also cut it out. For my sewing, I started by pinning the four dots on the cups. And I began the sewing. I pressed my dart laid my lace and satin cups with the wrong sides facing each other, folded in about three eight inches of the edges of the satin cups inwards and pin it to the lace cups. I also used my iron to make sure the folded edges stay put and I did the same for the armhole. process for the other cup. I 
I sold it with a zigzag stitch. I brought in my two cups, overlapped the front, while making sure it is accurate to the rest of the pattern. I sewed the cups together and brought in the lower part of the front pattern and sewed it together. I pressed the seam and the rest of the garment. Bringing in my back cutout, I added the strap to the back and the facing followed. Which I also sewed together. After the sewage, then I understitched the fabric excess to the facing. And for the sides, I pinned and joined it. And pressed open the seams. Sew my front straps using a zigzag stitch. And then I folded my facing in. Pinned it. And sewed it down from the front side. And finally hemmed the end of the garment by sewing one fourth inch first and then did another one foot on top of it. Press the sewn seam and my lingerie was ready.